Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do some double stamping. I've started off with Unt Peel Off Base Coat and I'll be using OPI's My Boyfriend Scales Walls. And this is just going to be like a base color. I'm going to go in with a it's, it's kind of a streaky, uh, you know, first coat, but I'm not worried about it. Uh, I just figured this would be a really good base for this glitter bomb I'm going to be breaking out here in just a moment. Being sure to cap that free edge. Sorry I'm out of frame. So there we go. We got the first coat on. I'm going to go in with the second coat of my boyfriend Scales Walls. And it's just like kind of a very, very light gray or a white with just a dot of gray in it. Hi Woody. Oh, he's got a fuzzy. Hi Woody, how you doing? So there we go, two coats of that. I'll be using Metamorphically Speaking from OPI. I picked this one up on clearance at my local Sally's in the last few days and could not wait to try it. I didn't figure I'd be able to build it up on its own, so that's why I used a base color. So there goes our first coat of Metamorphically Speaking, and Woody's back again. There we go. Doing a good job getting all the little fuzzies and polish off of me. And now we're going to go in with the second coat. I love this topper. It's just so pretty. And maybe you could build it up, but I just wasn't in the mood. You know, I just <laughs> did what I normally do. I layered up. Woody back again. There we go. I'll top it with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat and get it to dry down before we do some stamping. There we go. And I am just going to stamp a couple of accent nails today. I really like the way this one looked. There's a swatch photo of it all on its own. I'll be using You Are Beautiful number 19 today, as well as the Funky Fingers Dark Night not a stamping polish, and Clean Colors and Metallic Green, also not a stamping polish. I'll be using my Monocle Stamper and my Clear Jelly Scraper card. So I picked this image down here, it's speaking to me, it's a pretty cool image, but I'm going to stamp it in black first on my accent nails, I'm trying to line up that circle pretty close to the middle. <laughs> Very cool. Did a pretty good job of that. And we're going to do the middle and the ring finger today. So we're just going to swish this one out and get it on the nail. There we go. Try to line this up. There we got, got them both on there. And they look pretty cool like that. But we're going to go in with this metallic green. I just figured some double stamping was in the cards today. Now, polishes like this are kind of hard for me to see through the stamper to line up, so I do really good on this one. That one's like almost perfect. On the next one, I get it off to the side just a hair. I am cleaning that with some acetone and a cotton ball. But it's kind of busy, so it's not real noticeable. And I did think about putting a gemstone in the center circle, but I decided against it. So here we go. Having trouble lining that up. Mmm. There we go. <clears throat> Not too bad. So I am going to use a piece of tape to get this excess off of my fingers. And it's coming up like a dream. Look at that. It's just like, yes, please. Wish they all came up like that. Very easy cleanup. Loving it. And getting up under that fingernail. There we go. <clears throat> I am going to use this IMK uh, cleanup brush. I'm trying to get used to it. Um, I am learning about it. So as soon as I kind of feel comfortable with it, I will give you guys some, some of my thoughts on it. It is, um, it is a nice cleanup brush though. It's just you get used to what you use and then when you change, it takes a minute. See, IMK nails. Ta-da! I'm going to top this with the Born Pretty Smudge Free Top Coat so that I don't smear any. I don't think this would have smeared, but you know, I just don't take the chance anymore. And now I'm going to top it with some Posh Top Coat. Posh is back in play, y'all. <laughs> I 
nice glossy seal it in top coat shiny lovely and here is my swatch photo I hope you enjoyed this one leave me a comment let me know what you think about it because I always love hearing from you I want to thank you for watching until next time be good to yourself